Right, guys, uh, welcome back to another episode. We are at a abandoned mansion. Uh, this place is absolutely huge. Um, we're here tonight with uh, Moxley. You see the stairs there, look at the gothic design on these. Um, I was talking to Moxley before and he was saying there's a bit of a bad vibe upstairs. Like a really nasty, f oh yeah. Yeah, it feels weird. Ooh, all of the floor. Copper thieves have been in. Yeah, this is weird. Okay. Oh Jesus, watch your step shell. Mm. Mm. Don't feel right up here. Uh, still a tightness of breath up here. Pressure on the chest. Yeah. Yeah, there's a. I don't like this room. Severe though. tightening. Severe what? Tightening. Yeah. I don't like this room. So. Like trying to get your breath in there. Yeah, this is the place we're going to be investigating tonight. Oh, is that a big wasp nest or something? Looks like it. Yeah. That was a huge wasp nest at one point. Thank God it's not in there. That's weird, look, it's just a single chair. I don't like this room. No. What the hell? Did you guys hear that? There was a knock. Well, there was a knock in there then. Was there? Mm. Oh Jesus, I feel so dizzy up here. It's stifling like that. Look at these old stairs. Crazy. Right guys, we'll get some kit and uh, see what we can get. Um, other way. If there's anybody in here with us, can you go towards that device on the floor, please? Yeah. So there's just me and Yvonne. So I'm Cheryl and that's Yvonne. Can you come towards this device on the floor, please? If you go near it, if I show you how it works, what hurt you? If you just go near it, that's all it does.
I'll zoom in for you guys. There you go, there's the urn. So we're going to try and do some calling out in this room. This room feels a little bit strange. So if there's anyone here that would like to communicate with us, can you please walk through that door? There's a red light on the floor. Did you live here? This your house. Maybe you worked here. If that's correct. You can touch the green light if you prefer on the fireplace. If you worked here, or you have happy memories of this place. Ooh, nice light anomaly. Mm. Are you curious as to why we are here? Someone's been following us around tonight. What's oh, oh, behind me? <laughs> <clears throat> Strange when you look. You know, you look into the dark and it gets darker. Yeah. And you, just, and you think like someone's watching you. That's what it feels like just out there because it's so dark. You just feel like you've been watched. Can you come into this room, please? I know you're curious of us. I know you're very, very curious of the ladies. It's like, this one seems very drawn to the females. So. Can you come in this room to us then, please? Feels like, um, <clears throat> almost like a butler. You know, like um, a butler or a servant of some sort, but it's male. Curious of Jay at the moment. I think Jay will get something happening. There's somebody that's very curious of him. I just had this image of someone running up the stairs. It's almost like they're doing the rounds, they're checking on all of us individually. Yeah. They'll come in and check on us, they'll go check on Moxley, they'll go and check on Jay. Somebody's saying something about the lady of the house. Don't know who this is. Lady of the house. It's almost like they're talking about serving the lady of the house. So I feel like this person, person would have been um, a servant or uh, something along those lines, like a servant. Or um, he basically looked after the upkeep of the building. Yeah. There's also, I've been shown stables as well, I don't know why. I've been shown stables and horses. Something to do with horses and stables here. And the rims have just gone off. Um, I just saw what looked like hay. I was shown this hay and horses, stables. And it's almost like this person's tying the horses up and they're tying them to some sort of post outside and there's like two of these horses but I can see like a carriage as well it's like this black carriage but this carriage would have been special you know at this time yeah very special like only the elite of people the very rich would have had these carriages Well, from what I've seen, the previous owner was the owner of Cotton Mills. Mm. Yeah, it's like a very well-to-do society and also there's this imprint in this building as well of people mingling but people of importance mm. as well and money, transactions taking place. It's like deals taking place around the table. I can see like a big table and people 
exchanging paperwork and signing things. Um, it's almost like land. Mm. Can you step away from Lee, please? It's like they're projecting something onto me. There was a thud there. I heard the thud and it were in this room. Boom. Can Is I just... Is that my back? Can you take that away, please? Did you feel floor vibrate when that bang happened then? I didn't feel that, I just heard it, I just heard this boom. It was like around here somewhere. So I, I feel as well that the renovations to this place will have stirred it up quite a lot. So, you know, like the stripping things out and ripping the whole, like some of the walls down and stuff, it mm. feels like this will just add to the activity in this place. Yeah. But there's a lot of different spirits and different levels of spirits in this place. You've got um, basically the residual, which goes back a long, long time, which is passing through. Um, and then you go from the residual into what is the intelligent one, which keeps following us around, which is sort of intrigued with us, but very intrigued with the women. So you've got this whole different level and build up of uh, different spiritual energy you've got from the residual right through to the very intelligent as well. All right, Jay. Hello, guys. Well, Jay's just joining us now. Um, we just had like a thought in this room. Yeah, well, as uh, I put that then, put down. So we're at the bottom of the stairs. Um, <laughs> things are starting to happen. <laughs> it's it's right. Right. <laughs> a place like this. Oh, what was that, wasn't it? That's good. Should be scared. Should, should be scared, is that yeah. what he said? Yeah. Should be scared. Right, okay. this place, I've not seen anywhere on the internet anything yet. I've not yeah. seen anybody do any sort of investigations there. So it might be, we are a, a, be like one of the first people trying to communicate. I think we are the first paranormal team, team to yeah. investigate yeah. this building. Yeah. So Plus all our energy we might as get well. more and get like a static feel. Did you hear that? I heard that. That was, that was right hissed. behind her and it was a hiss. It was a. It was like a. I'm getting goosebumps all over. It's snap. I don't think this place has ever been investigated before. I think this is the first. There's a lot of energy. A lot. The energy's like static, you know, where the hairs on your hands stand on end. It's like really staticky, but I keep getting this image of this butler as well. Something hissed. We're talking about maybe the first people to do paranormal investigation that comes through. Should be scared. Then yeah. choice. 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 So it's like you should be scared. We're doing home. Oh, this is your choice. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. So whatever happens. This is real. This I heard <laughs> what sounded like a knock up there. It was a voice that it went something like So you've just heard a hiss. Hey, yeah. yeah. I heard that as well. I heard the you way did you hear the hiss? I heard the hiss. Would you, the basement, would you get out? Would you help? Would you help? Oh, I've got help as well. Can you stand on top of the stairs for us and make that machine bleep and we'll try and help you? We can't help you if you don't know where you are. Who's fucking breathing? Maybe there's four Relations. Can you touch the red light on the landing for me, please? Can you walk onto the landing to show us that you are here? We mean you no harm, we're just here to communicate with you and say hello. Was that your voice that we heard before? Guilty. 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 We've got a Hi. Hi. So that was your voice we heard before. That was really loud. Thank you for that. Yes, over, yes over here. Wow. Are you the butler? I keep getting like this image of um, like a butler going up the stairs, but he's, he's carrying like, you know, the candelabra, like the old really tight candle bad. going up there. You know, switches, what, like, putting in the bedrooms. Just mm. that yeah, there would have been like, I would think at some point, like servant bells and things in a house like this. Yeah. 
You live in a beautiful I'm home. I'm not playing games. I'm not Where? playing games. We had that, the bungalow. There I'm was, not playing games. There was just a knock in that room then. Was there? Yeah. All right, well, we've got REMs and everything now. We've got multiple REMs. We've got one at the top. We've got more than over there. Script. 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 I'm sorry. I'm sorry. So, weird things going on on the staircase. Where have you put your lampad? In this room. So you've got one pod in that back yeah. room. Jay, you put yours at the top there. We've got yeah. the motion sensor as well there. So you yeah. that light for me. Oh, I need to get my K2 actually. It's on the fireplace. There's no point in it just being sat there, is there? Yeah. Speak. 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 Don't have to be sorry. You don't have to be sorry. We just want to know where you are. Granddad. Why are you stuck here? See, the thing is, how old is it? 1800, I'd say. 1890, something Easily, like that. Yeah. Yeah. I and think it's more Edwardian than Victorian. If you think about it as well, if nobody has ever investigated this, like Mox said, there's going to be so much pent-up energy here. Yeah. They're going to have wanted for so long. You know, this is their first chance to speak to someone. Thank you. Hey, what did you see on that thing outside, Mox? Construct. The greenhouse. Construct. Yeah. It said cancer all the way across the greenhouse. In that inmate's fur, I think. You've got multiple layers of stuff in this one. We're only on the first floor yet. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so we get to the... Oh, that's you. <laughs> 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 I know, I thought I'd go practice. <laughs> I didn't know that excited. Gilbert. 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 I just need to walk back through this way and check this door. Oh, yeah, we propped that, didn't we? Oh, you propped yeah, it. Yeah, because you? just before everything started kicking off then, when you come out that room, I swear I heard something through the, and this is what we were going to do. He was going to go that way and I was going to come this way. Right. Are you up here? Your bathroom there. It's all like just downstairs and then spirit talk was going off, everything was starting to happen, Mox just got to check the back door. It's mad, isn't it? Yeah. Literally, as we was asking the question, he was answering and things we were like moving around. Yeah. Instantly like that. Like a bathroom. What's that up there? Oh, it would have been part of the curtains, I think. I think they're probably going to rip this wall out. We'll do this up for sure, this is a lovely place, but think of the activity that they're going to get when they do it. Well, the reason why it's probably so active is because of the renovations. Yeah. It stirs things up. I paint things at home and after. It's always renovations. You say what? Right, so I'm stuck in that door. Yeah. On there. And I heard like um, creak, like a I keep hearing things thing. in that room all the time. I keep getting drawn to that room there on the right. Yeah. Probably greenhouse in it outside yeah. of the house. Oh, trust me. Trust me. That's trust the word, trust. Whoa! Oh my goodness Christ, what might have I gone upstairs? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus, that's the hardest stuff. This is fucking nonsense. He's on edge, isn't he? He's on edge, he's the lad. He's an edge of place, isn't he? It is. Although I don't feel as... I feel quite calm in here now. This um, does, isn't it? Earlier on, it felt very different up here. Tension. That's all that tension. Wow, look at the size of these windows. That's me, guys. I mean, this is like the first floor we've got. More floors yet, and the cellar as well. Yeah, yeah, there's a cellar and four floors in here. 
I've not been in the cellar. It's like they've started to renovate it and run out of money. Yeah, exactly. Look at the basement. We've got lights and things on the roof. Yeah. I mean, there's a load of light fittings downstairs. You know, plastic fixtures. Um, just rescued a frog. Um, done my bit for nature. Put the frog out the window so he's all safe. He's uh, jumped off now. Poor dude was stuck down here. So this area. I've just been told to get out straight away. I turned left. All I heard was get out. Not nice at all. Wait, do you want the REM pod so you can place that wherever you. Yeah. It was here. So do you think perhaps in that doorway there? Yeah. There is water down here. Yeah. There's a pipe leaking into a bucket. Lee, there were movement in this room. Yeah, it shifts around, so proper shifts in here. Is that you moving around? I've heard you before. I'm back. I do not like this room. Oh, fucking hell, Lee. Sorry, there was something behind me then. Yeah, I don't like this Did room. Did you hear that? Room, Somebody's putting pressure on my head. That's you. Affecting my head, putting pressure on my head, make that red light flash. Who are you? Come into this room. Are you the one that was affecting Moxley when he was down here? Feels weird in here. I just feel really, really claustrophobic in this room. Are you affecting my head? I feel like I'm just literally spinning and spinning. Somebody's um, like gathering, you know, sort of a few of them. It's like they're gonna come in. But you get that calm before the storm. Yeah. I'm gonna do something. There's one down here that lurks in the shadows. He hides in the shadows. That's what the spirit talker said earlier. Hide in the shadows. That's exactly what he does. He hides in the shadows down here. And it's a male. It's a male. Is he from our time period or? He's from, uh, I would say the mid 1800s. Sort of 1850 to 1860. And what do you think he was, a caretaker or oh, this an guy owner? Was some sort of poacher. Poacher. He was a poacher of some sort because I see him hanging meat. He's stringing meat up. Um, but what he's wearing is like a farmer. And it's like he's almost got something over his shoulder. It's not, it's not like a gun, it's something else. He's also, he comes in here with dogs. He has dogs with him as well. And the dogs will be heard, you will hear barking. But these are obviously spirit dogs, but you will hear from time to time, you'll hear barking. And he's got like these typical gun dogs, you know, that farmers have. Yeah. But he's got three of these dogs. What's his name? Thomas. Thomas Fairbanks, Fairbank, Fairbank, Fairbanks. Something to do with Fairbanks, surname here. Why does 
come on. Why the TV side down here? He watches. He watches, somebody said. He watches. He likes to stand in these doorways as well, these two. Right here. <coughs> He's grumpy, this one. Really, really grumpy. Can you make a noise, please? It shows that you're here. You can walk into this room. Touch this red light on the floor. Do you want to put your necrophonic on me? Yeah. That'd be a... Yeah, we'll try the necrophonic. Move back to him pre focus, that's the first time it's ever said that and I'm stood where I've been always been stood. Yeah. It come up on my phone then. This is absolutely mad. <laughs> Boom. Did you hear it? Yeah. Boom. <laughs> Thomas, are you hiding? Are you hiding in the dark? What did that say? I haven't got a clue. Something Come like, in. do something to them or so it was like, jab them or something. Like do you want to harm us? Oh my. I really don't like it. Down what here. did it say then? It sounded like he said they, but as he said that, I just got this image of somebody crawling down the wall, you know, literally like. Slip. What was that? You know that it said get off. The minute I got grabbed on my arm, somebody said get off. Something grabbed my arm. The back of my arm, they tugged on my arm. I'm not turning the light off again. Yeah, it's bearing down. It's like, I just, it just feels weird, you know, because there's somebody behind me. Here. Thomas. What did Thomas just do to me? Did he grab me? He Who grabbed my arm? Tell me who did that. Fuck you. you. Said? Fuck you. Yeah. Look, look, we're not scared of you. We're in the dark again. And you see, I've got my back to you now. I can feel you around. I know you're circling. He's right there. He's there. He's there. He's right there. I don't like him. What does he look like? Horrible. Scraggly beard. His hat. Did you hear the female then? She just went behind you. Was that in this room? Yeah. Yeah, she went, whoo, right behind you. She stood there. Right behind me? Yeah, she's there. If I turn round. Oh my God, somebody just breathed on me. Did you just breathe on me? This is horrible. I'm just going to put the light on so the viewers can see. Um, this is absolutely horrible down here. I've got that sick feeling again. Yeah. I really don't feel comfortable down here. It's like I'm being... What did that say? I feel like I'm being grabbed at. Hands are grabbing at me. Why are you grabbing me? No. Was it the male? Did 
Did Thomas grab me? German. Sprachen Sie Deutsch? There's something to do with German. You get grabbed on the pocket then, the back, your back pocket. Like yeah, that one. Yeah. Did you see them do it? No, I just got a mental image of them doing it. I didn't see them, but I saw them in my mind doing it. To me? Yeah. Somebody twanged it. They didn't grab it. They, like, yeah. pulled it and let it go back. Yeah, they like that. It. Yeah. Get them. Did you hear that? Yeah. Get them. You're not getting anybody. Thomas. Go. Thomas. If you want us to leave this basement, can you do something really big for us, please? I do not feel comfortable uh, for the first time in a long time. I've not felt this uneasy since the Mog. I do not feel... I wish you guys could feel what we're feeling down here. This is really not nice. I don't know how we've lasted as long as we have been on this. Who are you? This. Come on. Do you, do you not like the renovations here? Do you not like change? Where's the female? Sophie, that says Sophie. Yeah. Do you hear that kid? Said something scary, something. Who's the child that's here? Are you a girl? Or are you pretending to be a child? Yep. Tell me how old you are, please. Thomas, can you hear my voice? Thomas. Did you hear him? Yeah. Bastard. Thomas. Yeah, of course I'm here. Yeah, you're lurking down here, aren't you? Thomas, do you like being here? Are you still looking after the property? What did that say? No, Mox, Moxley said he felt like there was a child down here as well. Like somebody tugged on his leg. Is there a, is there a child here? Thomas, is that you? Why do you like to scare people here? Is this your area? Weird. This is something. Thomas, can you say your name again? Thomas. Do you hear him? How many of you are there? Hello. Do you hear him? Yeah. 
Thomas. And some of them. Three. Yeah. In this basement. Yep. Tell me how many there is. I know you're watching us. Can you come and stand in this doorway? Tickle. Are you going to tickle us? I think we should go all dark. I'll do some filming, but without the light Moxley. on. Moxley? It said Moxley. Go. Right, guys. What can I say? What a night. Uh, struggling for light. Um, mega activity, especially in the basement at the end. Um, it's just something I can't explain at all. Thomas down there telling me to get out as soon as I got in there. Um, earlier on I said that um, Jay would have activity upstairs. He had activity upstairs. Moxley yeah. had activity in the basement. Yes. When I said, uh, he's right there. So he had the activity in the basement, didn't you, Mox? Uh, yeah. Jay had activity upstairs. Yeah. It's been all round cracking night. Really enjoyed it. Yeah. Um, it's been good to see Mox again. It's been a while. It has. It's almost a year, mate. A year. a year. Wow. So yeah, we'll see you on the next one, guys. Take care.